Hello everyone. Question number 18 is a number of three digits. Now, as we know that the writing a number of two digits is 10x plus y, so writing a number of three digits must be 100x plus 10y plus z. Because x is at the 100th place, 10, y is on the 10th place and z is at the unit place. So this is the way in which we can write a three digit number. This has 100th digit four times the unit's digit. It means the 100th digit is x which is equal to four times the unit's digit that is z. And the sum of three digits is 14 that means x plus y plus z. The sum of three three digit is already known to us as 14. The third is if the three digits are written in reverse order, the value of the number is decreased by 594. It means 100x plus 10y plus z. Now, if I uh, write in the reverse order, so this will become 100z plus 10y plus x. What I am doing is that the middle digit will remain as it is because if there is a 3 digit number like 325 and I am to write it in reverse order that will become 523. The tenth digit will remain as it is and these two digits will replace themselves. And now this number is decreased by 594 that means that the reference is 594. So this is the first equation, <coughs> second equation and this is the third equation. If I am closely relating the third equation, then this is 100x, this is 1x, so it is 99x. 10y will be cancelled by 10y and z is minus 100z to minus 99z and this equals to 594. That means the value of x minus z becomes 6. <coughs> this is one equation and these are the first two equations. So from here and from first equation, we can solve the value of x or we can solve the value of z. Because when we know the value of x as 4z and if I am putting this value in this equation, so this equation will be written as 4z minus z is equal to 6. Or I can write 3z is equal to 6 or the value of z becomes 2. Now it is very clear that the value of z is 2. We know the value of x is 4z and when the z value is 2, it means the value of x will become 4 multiplied by z is equal to 8. So the value of x becomes 8. We know x plus y plus z is 14. So the value of x is already known, the value of z is already known. So when we write that x plus y plus z is equal to 14. So the value of x is 8, the value of z is 2. So we have to solve the value of y. So the value of y becomes 14 minus 8 plus 2 is 10 and that is 4. Now we know the value of x, y and z and our number was already 100x plus 10y plus z. So this will be written as 842. So this is the original number for which we are talking about and this is the correct answer. If you have any problem, you can contact or email us. Thank you.